Why does my face look like it's a different color than the rest of me? Oh, it's just the lighting. Aw, oh, come on! Hey guys, it's Jenny, and yeah, I'm back from, uh, you know, that thing playlist that happened in Florida. Yeah. So, playlist was amazing, and, uh, this week's theme is Story Week, and I was gonna talk about it, but instead I'm actually just gonna make an- ooh. Instead, I'm actually just gonna make an entire video all about playlist on my channel. Ignore the fact that I am sick and I probably sound like a child, but it's just what happens when I get sick, it's not my fault. So the story that I'm gonna tell is a story that people tend to enjoy hearing just because it's kind of weird and kind of bad. But this is a story of how I got my cat. For those of you who don't know, I have a cat. Uh, her name is Kitty very original. She looks like this. And yeah, she's a devil. I think it was not last summer, but the summer before that we got her. So my mom was telling my sister and I about um, how our neighbors down the street uh, wanted to buy a boat from the mother of another neighbor down the street. And uh, when they bought the boat, they brought it over to their house and they looked inside and there were just a bunch of cats inside of the boat. Not knowing what to do, clearly the obvious thing to do was to take the cats and let them go in the woods. That's what you do when you find stray animals. So our other neighbors found out about this and they were like, are you dumb or are you just dumb? So a few neighbors went out and they found a bunch of the cats. Uh, I think they found them all, I'm not positive, but they found a bunch of the cats, they brought them all home, and they had um, different uh, vets said that they would, uh, vets in like shelters said that they would like take them, um, but they couldn't take all of them, so they had like a bunch of different places say that they would take them. So they only had two cats left by the time that we had found out about this. And so my sister and I were like, can we go see them? And my mom was like, yeah, sure, I guess, all right, we can just go and look. We've wanted a cat for years. Did you really think that that was gonna go down so smoothly? So we walk into their backyard and we just see these two cats in like these little little tiny cages and one of them was um, uh, like, like a blackish and white color. I don't know, it wasn't exactly black, it was just very dark uh, with some white on him. And uh, he was so loud and he was just like meowing and and we were just like, uh, I don't really like that one. And then we saw this other cat who was just like, like curled up in the back of its cage. And we were like, oh, you're so cute. We were just like looking at that cat. We were like, mom. She just looked at it. She was like, don't even think about it. We basically just kind of told our neighbor, if we come knocking on the door, just give us the cat and walk away like nothing happened. So we walk back down the street and we're like telling her mom, we're like, come on, like, we're gonna get the cat. Like, we just, we need this cat. And she's like, no, you don't need the cat. You're not getting it. My mom had to go out to the bank a few moments later. And when she left, my sister and I had a plan. What we did was we took the money that I had saved, her car, and we drove to Petco. We bought a cage, food, toys, bowls, litter box, litter litter scooper, everything. And we came back, put everything in her room, and then her mom got home. And we said, hey, we uh, we got a bunch of stuff for the cat and uh, we're gonna go get her, right now. She just looked at us like, she, like we were crazy. She was like, uh, no you're not. You're actually gonna go, you're gonna bring all of that stuff back. And actually for a while, she didn't even believe us that we actually had the stuff. We were like, we can show you right now. So we like showed her all the stuff and she was like, you're going to take all of this back right now because we're not getting that cat. So we went into our rooms and we were like, fine, we're just not going to talk to you ever again. Sounds good. We locked our doors and we just stayed there and she was like, guys, come on. Nothing. Guys, come on. Nothing. After a few minutes, she caved and she and my sister went down the street and brought the cat back. And that's the story of how my sister and I tricked our mom into letting us get a cat. We're terrible daughters. Never do that. <laughs> my sister and I just happened to be very 
determined people and very stubborn. So yeah, we uh, we spontaneously got a cat. She's been great, she's a devil, but that's okay. So I hope you like that, and I hope you never ever ever do anything like that to your parents, because that is not good. I hope you guys are alright with the fact that we had a little skip week last week. Um, it was just easier because Sarah and I were uh, coming back from Florida and Michelle was leaving for Florida. And um, it was just easier for everyone if we just took a little break for a week. So that is what happened last week. And um, we might have to do something like that again if anything ever comes up like that where like no one can post. So that is what happened. Again, thank you guys for watching and make sure that you like and subscribe and comment and you know, you do all those fun things because fun things are fun. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Goodbye!